So, okay, we have here, well, last time we got a haircut was probably January, right? Yeah. Oh, well, you've got very nice hair, but school requires him to get a short haircut. So this is for people that always criticize me for cutting your hair short. This is what they want, not what I want. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so let's get that clear. So please, no more comments. All, all that beautiful It looks hair. better with the long hair. I don't care how it looks. This is what I have to do. This is my job, okay? <laughs> so what are we going to do here today? We're gonna do actually undercut on both sides. And undercut will probably, we'll see how short we go, but probably around three, because the picture he showed, he showed me is not a fade. And then we'll leave the top longer and he kind of has a pushback, okay? All right, well, let's go, guys. Action. These were designed by All right, so we're gonna, the we shaped it up. We tried to balance as much as possible here from the corner of his hairline, but his hairline goes up and down, so it's fine. So basically here and here, we're trying to be square, okay? and then we'll cut the, the sides and the back short. We're not gonna cut all the way to the top, so I'm gonna leave some hair here, but short here, and then we'll cut the top to go back, okay? We'll see you next. Ready, my friend, let's go. All right, so here we go, all this hair, keep your head straight up. Okay, perfect. So I'm trying to actually see blend with my first stroke. Right there. Nice and easy. Alright guys, uh, the comments I get about these clippers, they are very loud. They do sound very loud on camera, but in person they are not that loud. So they are actually very nice camera clipper. The clipper that I'm using is Aster Octane. It has detachable, detachable blades. You can use Andy's blades on this clipper as well, or wall blades. Most of the blades that I use, use are actually uh, Andy's, but this one is Aster. Okay. Action. All right, so we're gonna just shape up now. Okay, the edges I'm using actually came. Um, they are actually very quiet and, and very nice. I, I really like these edges. And I try to keep the, the hairline natural. I don't go too too much into hairline, whether it's here, here, or in the front. Taper the back from zero. Yes. Look down. So we're gonna start our fade from zero here. When you have a headline like this, really, I mean, the taper should start from somewhere here. You see, because it's weak here and here, and then you have here, 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 and here. Mm -hmm. So I, I should go pretty high here. Well, let's try to leave the edges here. And now we're gonna taper. I have number one here with my open blade. And we're gonna work on this taper here. The clipper that I'm using is uh, by Caliber and the model is 50 cal. It's actually a very nice clipper. It's very quiet. It's a magnetic motor. It has these clicks here, click, click. Uh, it really is a nice clipper. I like it. I use it a lot. The only thing is about this clipper, I don't like the uh, guards, so I use wall guards. And two, it's slightly difficult, uh, heavy, excuse me. It's a little heavier than Magic, but otherwise a really nice clipper.
Put your chin down for me. Perfect. Muy bien. What we're gonna do now that we are done with the sides, we're gonna uh, just connect the top here since uh, the top actually is gonna be undercut, so we're gonna just blend this to the side. It's gonna be slightly longer, so let's use a razor and kind of sculpt this into the sides. As a matter of fact, not too long ago, someone asked me on YouTube to do a haircut like this where it's not a fade. Uh, on the side and under console. Here we go. This actually worked out perfect. The razor I'm using, I get questions what razor is it? The razor I'm using right now, it's by Tondeo. It, the model is a uh, Tondeo uh, Swifter, Swifter, Tondeo Sifter style. However, this was a uh, special edition and they don't make this particular one anymore however they have a, a Tondeo Sifter Classic which we have and will have it available on our website uh, if you want you can just contact me uh, through social media or anywhere and I'll tell you how to purchase it but soon we'll have we're redoing our website we'll have all our tools on the website Are they making them on their own now? Not during, not during the game. They use some uh, on the sideline where they're playing good. They make all the parents wear them. I, for soccer, they make the parents wear them on the sideline. They're pretty hot. They're good baseball, they don't. Okay. So, you see? Now that that is done, we're going to cut the top and we're going to do undercut on both sides. So, we're going to take sections starting from crown. No but here you see that I left this long so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna take my guys from underneath that way even though I have an undercut I can see my guy right here even though I have my undercut on both sides back I always like to uh, connect I don't like to have under undercut on the back All right so here we go There you go. So on the back is going to be blended, but the red, the sides will be disconnected. He's got very nice hair. He's got very thick hair. So actually, the, the, the razor cut will work very good for him. See his hair is very straight, so if you don't create texture inside, it will just fall flat. It will split on, on the middle and just fall to the side. It's going to fall to the side. So this way, by creating texture inside, especially when he puts product, it will stay uh, together and it will create small volume and stay back. So can you see your classroom when you're going in? No. You just see the teacher's class. Yeah. Okay. But the kids are in the background, right? You follow me camera guy? Mm-hmm. Is it Shanwal? Mm-hmm. Shanwal? Shanwal? Follow me camera guy? Remember that commercial, no? No. Shanwal? Yeah, well sometimes you take sometimes <laughs> uh, section. So on this section, is our section that we're going to cut from inside because we don't want to have uh, short hair 
on the front sticking out, okay? So we're gonna cut it from this side. See, right here. I'm gonna take it this way and just... Come over there. So this is our razor cut, as you can see. See that? All right. So what we're gonna do with the scissors? Just kind of like see if there's any long ones. I heard right up. See that? All right, perfect. And as for his phone line, we're gonna keep it natural. He doesn't want. Uh, he doesn't want any uh, shape up. So let's blow dry and see how it looks. It's got a really nice hair though, very thick. Paste here, just a little bit of this, and this here should be. <laughs> so I need to school like a that. king, man. <laughs> As soon as they walked in, we started talking about it. That's that MC sauce. Yeah. 
Going to Catholic school of the Sopranos, man. What's going on? <laughs> oh. This is where classic meets the trend. So we have a number cut, but yet we have a classic look. Uh, it's, it's going to...